Many of you have asked me, how do you list an item on LooksRare? Today, I'm gonna to show you how from start to finish. Let's get right into it. First, go to LooksRare.org. Uh, check that it has the lock on it. Make sure it's the correct site, LooksRare.org. Then go to your profile at the top right. Go to your items. Of course, you have to have NFTs in your MetaMask wallet in order to sell any items. Go down to your wallet and then choose the item that you want to sell. So it's pretty simple to actually list an item on LooksRare. But most importantly, you wanna know how to evaluate the value of your item. And LooksRare has a great feature on how to check the value of your item. Here's the item I want to sell, it is a Voxy. And there's a few important details about this Voxy that is gonna add the value to the item that I wanna check into a little bit. So if I wanted to just simply sell it, I already knew what the value was worth, I'd click sell, and then I'd input the price in ETH, and I'd say how long that I want it to be listed for, 30 days is fine, I'd list the item. But I wanna check how much these particular traits are worth. So if I go to about, it tells me what is the value of each of these particular properties of my item. So it tells me the floor price. You know, So if I scroll down, uh, you'll see here that I'm looking for the one that has the highest value, right? Uh, it'll, it looks like that this level of intelligence on this item carries the floor prices one Ethereum, so that's pretty good. The crab, that this little pet down here, not all these items have a pet, so this one, the floor price is 1.6. So I wanna make sure that I'm getting uh, you know, enough value for this item. It is a, it's a robo class, and if I go down, it is a uncommon. So let's check out what a robo uncommon uh, is currently worth. And it might be that the actual pet gets, drives the value of this item. But let's go ahead and check into that. So I'll select robot, and you'll see that it filters the market for any item that has that robot particular class. And then I wanna go down to, I wanna go down to rarity to check for uncommon rarity. And you'll see that the robot uncommon, the lowest listed price is two Ethereum right now. So I wanna make sure that when I sell my item, if I want it to sell, right, then I would list it around this price, maybe slightly below. And that's what I think I'll do today. Uh, we saw earlier that the, the crab adds, you know, it, it's a driver of a, a base price of around 1.69, but the robo class that's uncommon is around two Ethereum. So I'm gonna list mine at around 1.9 Ethereum in hopes that it will sell. So let's show you how easy that is. So I'm gonna go back to my profile to find my item, select my item, and I'm gonna click sell, and I know what price I want to sell it at, 1.9 Ethereum, okay? And then I, for 30 days, this, this auction will be valid for. You'll see here's the fees. So creator royalty fees are from Voxy themselves. That's pretty high, around 10%. That has nothing to do with the LooksRare platform. Uh, that is from the project themselves. So LooksRare as a platform is gonna take 2% fees. That's less than OpenSea at 2.5%. So that is a deal. So I'll list the item. If it's your first time listing the item, it'll make you approve the collection. I've already listed an item in Voxies before, so I don't have to do that. That is a very small gas fee. I'm gonna click sign to complete my listing, and now my item is listed. So if I sell this item, I will receive 1.9 Ethereum in WEF, and I hit escape, and I've completed the listing of my item. So now, if you are curious about, well, I heard that you get some rewards back if you sell the item. How does that work? So let me show you that today. If you're here just to learn how to list the item, I've already shown you how to do that and the video for you is probably over. But if you wanna know also, how do you determine the value you get back for selling this item on the LooksRare platform that's a benefit to you? Go ahead and from the LooksRare site, you're gonna scroll down to the bottom and you're gonna see learn more about looks. Go ahead and click on that. From there, you wanna scroll down, it brings you to this site here. You're gonna scroll down to trading rewards and we're gonna calculate the trading rewards uh, for this particular item. So we determined that uh, we are selling this item for around 1.9 ETH. So we'll do 1.9 and ETH price currently is at 2,600. So 1 1.9 times 2,600 would be around $4,900 US dollars. And 
here it tells you how are the trading rewards calculated. So it is your volume in trading. So that would be my $4,900 if I sell it. And then the total platform trading volume in a day. We have to determine that. So if we go to the Dune platform, it tells us the total trading volume in the past 24 hours is 106 million. So we have 4,900 divided by 106 million. Okay, and now we need to multiply that by the looks rewards per day. This is C. And we're currently in phase B, uh, which is at the 585,000 block height. For the next 90 days, we're looking at our looks reward per day of around 1,361,000 looks per day. So we're gonna calculate that times 1,361,587, and that will give us 63 looks token for selling this item on the looks platform. How much money is that? So if we go and we look, what is the current looks rare token value? It's $1.56, so we multiply this times $1.56, and you get an extra 98 bucks just for selling on their platform and also having reduced fees at around 2%. So Looksware has been very responsive to the community. They're adding features every day and they have a lower fee of 2% compared to OpenSea's 2.5%. Also, OpenSea has had a lot of different issues come up lately with phishing scams and other sort of scams in their projects that people have lost their NFTs. And I'm not blaming OpenSea in particular, That's, that should be on the hackers. However, OpenSea has not been communicating well with the community and that's created some problems. So many people are moving to looks rare and you'll see how easy it was to use the platform and uh, they're brand new, right? You're gonna save some money and you're also gonna earn some looks tokens along the way. Drop down in the comments below if you've listed any of your NFTs on looks rare and if you had a good experience. Like this video if you liked it, subscribe to my channel and I'll see you next week.